born and tell me a little bit about that so people know your background before we get to your green card story. Okay, I'm Jamaican too. I've been here about 20 years. I, I basically spent most of my life in Jamaica already. I came here when I was in my late 20s. People in the room, please show your hands. Just type <laughs> Fern Court into the comments. Yes. A woman, of Fern Court, a woman of the maroon and white. Oh, yes, of the maroon and white. I'm from Fern Court from the 1991 graduating class. Nice. So yeah. you and I went through Fern Court at the same time. Just about, yes. And when I look at age and I look how we look good. And I see Toby. Yes, we look all at all. Of course, <laughs> I was, for, for those of my non Jamaican friends, I'm saying, that we don't look our age, even though we graduated high school back in 1991. So you graduated in 1991, mm -hmm. and then, excuse me, drop the glasses. You know, I have to be able to see. And then you immigrated to the United States? Well, I immigrated um, close to the turn of the century. That's mm -hmm. when I immigrated. Okay. You know, I'd work, I worked back home as an elementary school teacher. And then, uh, you know, opportunity came around for me to come here. And so I decided, okay, mm -hmm. I am going to seize the moment. I'm going to come and see what was going to happen. And um, so much has happened over the years. It's just unbelievable. So you formed this group online. It's called mm -hmm. Diaspora. Mm -hmm. Why did you form this group? What was the purpose and goal of Diaspora? Well, I, want, I wanted an outlet. I wanted a place to express myself. I've been through so much with my immigration story sort of journeys over all the experiences and i just wanted an outlet to share my experiences with people to hear other people's stories and to pull strength so we can pull strength together and everybody can learn and i'm so glad that you came on because now that you have the the legal authority Mm -hmm. to speak on the immigration matters that matter to me, then the people who I speak to can be referred to you. Right. And that is how we connected because I saw mm -hmm. your story, you shared my post, and ultimately we found out we were Fern Court sisters. So thank you again for sharing those posts. You're so, welcome. So the purpose and goal of diaspora is to help people settle, help people learn the culture and assimilate into this society. Right. Right. Um, and Want them also to understand that there are lots of challenges out here lots of challenges and when you come out and you face challenges you don't just pack up and run back home mm -hmm. you, there are challenges you have to face them and you have to 